My name's Lou Michaels. I reside in Ocala, Florida. Been in Florida for 35 years. Originally born in Michigan. Uh, I started this concept about seven years ago, and it was happenstance. I found some really iconic images that I liked, and I just wanted to see if I could capture the flavor of that air through my sculpture. And I was simply sitting them out front to see if I had captured those images. And it evolved from that to get this 3D perspective that you see here now. And with that, I perfected a technique. It's called cold cast bronze that I use. And you use actual bronze powder to replicate bronze without having to go to a foundry. I can keep that in-house and do that process. And additionally, the other feature that I use with my sculptures is I actually buy fabric, blue jean material, linen material, and I hand sew every outfit on every sculpture. And I apply those handmade clothing to the sculpture and through that process you get a layer of realism through the texture and the creases and the bends in the fabric that I use. These are old iconic images that I found through some older image banks. I buy the copyrights to use them in this capacity as the backdrop, as the focal point. And I do a little manipulation to get the color right and to get the scale right. Well, first I, I use clay as my medium. I use plasticina clay and it's all hand sculpted. And again, I layer it with the clothing, with the process of, of making sewing and finding the right material for what I think is right for that image. And uh, sometimes I'll use blue jeans, sometimes I'll use linen. And so that all has to go onto the armature as part of it and the sculpting comes in right behind it and then I make a mold, a silicone mold and then I do a casting as I mentioned earlier, a bronze casting. I started in Ann Arbor. My cousin was a famous ceramicist at the University of Michigan and I would spend summers with him when he was on vacation at the school and we'd go do art shows and I learned my trade and my craft through him. I think it has a lot of appeal. I think people really equate, you know, bronze sculpture with value. They all lend themselves to a perspective of Americana history. It's all historical, and I think it was a special place in time in America, and I think people have a real place in their heart for that.